Hey guys, and happy Vlogmas Day 23. How's everyone's day going? I'm on break, and I'm extremely, I'm sleepy. Like, I'm, I'm really sleepy, I'm not gonna even lie. <sighs> I'm sleepy. Um, but I need to get up. I need to clean up my room. I need to clean up the house. I know y'all must have like, Erica, you always clean up. That's because it always gets dirty. Well, I don't necessarily say it gets dirty, but I just be having clothes everywhere. So I need to get up. I need to finish working. I need to finish tidying up. I have to run to the store. I have to run to the hospital and try to figure out what I'm gonna eat tonight. I think I want Chinese food again. Not really sure, but I'm about to get up and finish working so that um, when I get off, I can just go to the store, get whatever I gotta get, hopefully clean up, because I do want Chinese food tonight. So, I guess I should just get up. <sighs> hey guys, happy Vlogmas Day 23. We are two days away from Christmas. It's only two days away. Um, We're two days away from Christmas. Can you believe it? We're literally two days away from Christmas. I am just getting out the house because I'm just getting off work. I am finally going to meet my brother. It only took a whole 24 hours, right? I'm finally going to go meet my brother. And we're going, I'm, I need to go to five and below. And then I need to go to the store. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if y'all remember Julius, but if you're one of my OD but goodie subscribers, you'll remember Julius. <laughs> Julius is in the hospital. He has a upper respiratory infection. And if you follow me on my socials, and if you follow me for a while, you'll know that Julius went through a lot. Um, he had to, um, ready to beat the horn at you. If you don't like get out the way. Thank you. Sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Forgive me. But um, Julius recently this year in February, February the 8th to be exact, he got a heart transplant. So he has a new heart. He has a new start on life. But it... <laughs> Um, when when he, when they first started talking about like the surgery, I was asking questions. I was like, well, what if his body starts to reject the heart? And they were like, well, we're gonna do everything, you know, preventative to help that. So happily, Julia's body cannot build up antibodies. So you know the antibodies in our body that helps us fight colds and all that good stuff? Julia's body cannot produce those. If it does, it's going to reject the heart because his body is like, eh, foreign object, let's eat it up, let's kill this. You know, the same way a cold does or the flu does or anything else does. And so his body can't build up those antibodies and his body has been building up antibodies slightly. And so they started to give him chemo shots to help suppress that. So happily, the chemo shots weakened his immune system so bad. He end up, he doesn't go out like that. When he does, he may go visit his dad. His dad is in the hospital or he may like go to his doctor's appointments or you know, like to the grocery store, like basic places that you go. And um, it kind of caused him to get a upper respiratory infection. So he needs all of the good stuff to help build up a little bit of the, his antibodies. So he needs some lemon, some lime, and some power aid. So I'm going to meet my brother at Applebee's. I'm going to stop at Kroger to pick up the lemon, the limes, and the Gatorade. Um, 
and then I really do need to clean up because the way y'all saw me earlier, <clears throat> I don't want y'all to see me like that no more because I really, like, I'm exhausted. I am going through, um, I don't want to say mental because my mental is good, but I've been just going through emotionally, like, through emotional, uh, things within my life, within my personal life. Um, not relationship, but family-wise. And I kind of sort of feel like it happens every year around this time. It, it's something that always comes and occurs. And it kind of sort of just knocks me off my game a little bit. But it's nothing my God cannot do. It's not, nothing my God can't fix. It's nothing my God cannot handle. Um, I just have to trust the process that's all that is and same thing I was encouraging Julius with because Julius is feeling down because he won't be gone for Christmas and I was encouraging him and I was like you know it's one Christmas you're still alive that's the most important thing and so um I've been really tired lately so um me actually trying to get myself out of the house to do stuff has actually been helping me, um, honestly. So, yeah, that's why I'm like really happy, like meet my brother, see my brother, you know, get out the house at least, like go to the hospital to visit Julius. I really don't know how this is gonna work. I have not been to a hospital since about March after Julius came home. Um, so yeah, um, but it's gonna be an adventure. So. Y'all know what I want to, y'all know. Let go. All right, so I'm back from Kroger. Well, this came out of Kroger. And if any of y'all know Kroger, like I know Kroger, I used to work at Kroger. I, w I wipe my hands already. Just, just, you know, just throwing it out there. And if you know Kroger, Kroger has some of the best fried chicken. Grace. Mm. Kroger hands down has some of the best fried chicken. So I haven't really eaten much today because I really don't have an appetite. So I'm going to scarf this down. Or we can get up the highway. Get y'all some Kroger chicken. Who has the best fried chicken? It'll be me then Kroger. And this just came out the grease. Mm, too bad I didn't give me anything to drink. Mm. But I got water here in the car. Um, I should be fine. I'm just wasting y'all time. Y'all watch me eat some. Let's do this the fast version. I'm at the nail bread for Julius, picking him up some dinner. Um, I can't show him for obvious reasons, but um, I am here. 
um, and he's doing good. He sounds better. So yeah, um, he's a little sad that he's gonna be here for Christmas, but the good thing is, is that he's still here, right? So keep genius in your prayers um, while we get this food. Okay, guys. All right, so my visit is over and he's doing good. So that's what makes me feel better. Now I have laid eyes on him. It's always the case. I feel a lot better once I lay eyes on him. Um, I'm about to head home and clean up because I was supposed to do that earlier and probably get ready for bed. Um, I'm freezing. I'm really, really cold. Um, it's not that cold out here, but it's my iron is low. So that's what's going on with me. But I appreciate y'all for going with me um, to see my buddy. <sighs> So, let's head home. <laughs> I am home. And I've cleaned up. I am about to take a shower. And I'm about to lay down. I really, 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 I don't feel good right now. I have no idea as to why, but I don't feel really good right now. So I'm gonna take an Alka Seltzer. Um, I'm gonna drink a ginger ale, and then I'm gonna, I'm more than likely, I'm gonna be going to sleep. But I hope you guys have enjoyed the vlog. Tomorrow, we gonna shop till we drop. And yo, yo, make a wicked cup of cocoa. <laughs> but yeah, tomorrow, we're gonna do some last minute Christmas gifts. And then it's Christmas, guys. And I'm gonna take you all on an amazing Christmas day with me. So, it's been fun. But... Good night, guys.